Oh, look, I've got a lot of belief in my team. You know, I think we've, we've worked really hard, trained really hard. We only had a short space of time, really, between the rugby championship and, and this tournament to get some good building blocks in around fitness and, um, and also resilience, not just fitness, resilience for the contact. Um, we know it's going to be extremely physical and, uh, and we want to be able to last that. So <clears throat> uh, I, I believe we've prepared accordingly. You, you know, once the 80 minutes starts, not only will your preparations take a hold, but also a lot of the reasons that, that are driving you mentally, I think that takes over the physical part and you only feel the physical parts later. Pretty much their modus operandi, you know, they, they know how to play the game physically. They've got great leg drive and, um, and uh, they've got great intent around the way they want to play the game physically. And I, I, I love that style of play as well. So uh, we know that um, we want to bring that too. We want to bring physicality to the game as well. I know we're probably a little bit smaller, but, uh, but it's all about how you bring it technically. And then, like I said, what's inside you? What's your drive? Why, why do you want to do it? And, and that will give you the fuel to, to play the game physical. One of our goals as a team has been to um, get our, our supporters in Australia enjoying the game again. And, uh, and that's really important to us. That's genuine. It's not, it's not marketing. I'm not from the marketing department. That's, uh, that's from the rugby players to other rugby players and supporters that play the game in Australia. We show them the values that they want to be attached to with the Australian rugby team. So that's, that's been positive for us, really positive. And, um, and we want to give them more to be proud of on Saturday night.